Hi friends, today we are going to talk about supplement called serapeptase or also scientific name serotiopeptidase. The supplement is usually used for benign airway stenosis, tracheal, laryngeal, vocal cord stenosis and scarring, subglottic stenosis. In people who has past medical history of surgeries and they were intubated due to surgery, so damage was created. People who have long-standing uh, acid reflux. Although I have to say that I look, I, I look deep and wide, and there is no exactly scientific literature that connects long-standing acid reflux with airway stenosis. Athletes who used to inhale forcefully and may have a scarring of, uh, of vocal cords, uh, singers who use and overuse their vocal cords. Uh, people who have allergies, and also there is idiopathic, air, idiopathic airway stenosis, means that we do not know what that actually cause is. Idea of using um, enzymes for the airway stenosis in, uh, my, uh, in, the, in my clients came to me because in my uh, medical practice, I used to use enzymes and I use pancreatic enzymes internally and topically treat people who had um, uh, big scars and then created a lot of pain and discomfort. So I use enzymes, but a person, my, my uh, client came with the idea of using serapeptase. Because I did not have enough experience, she asked me to do a research on this topic. And this is the result of the research. So we do not know what the effective dose is, meaning that once when you take a supplement, um, at which dose people will have bio biological response. We do not know effective dose of 50, meaning that when uh, people take supplement, 50% of these people will have biological response. We do not know effective dose 95, meaning when the people take the supplement, 95% of the people taking certain amount of supplement will have biological response. We do not know the side effects of the supplement, although I want to say that there is a data of using this supplement for many years in naturopathic medicine, uh, particularly in Europe. What interesting, um, my um, client took uh, um, uh, brought my attention to the fact that not every supplement of this enzyme is uh, using SPU units. Um, some of the supplements use milligrams. So we find that there is a conversion. One milligram is equal 100 uh, IUs. In the description below, I post links into some uh, research articles. The supplement is actually being used in otolaryngology in dentistry. And it was used as anti-inflammatory substance, fibrinolytic, um, anti-biofilm uh, forming analgetic, and uh, to prevent edema. They are stating that they see effect and pretty good effect in seven to eight days. Also, they point out that there is a meager literature is available on absorption of this supplement and the safety of the supplement. I want to tell you that um, my client and I, we decided that she is going to take 100,000 I use per day because she found on a patient forum that it was a one person who was taking this high doses for benign airway stenosis and had a good effect. And we decided that she's going to do that high dose, high dose of the supplement for a reason. Because in a matter of six months, she is going again for a um, procedure to um, to delay her airways because, you know, airways is a pipe. And um, in a matter of six times, uh, she had, a, again, it's become narrow and also their um, connective tissues get formed there. So uh, she said, you know, this is not the way of, uh, to live my life, to go for this procedure every six months. So we decided that she's going to take high dose, 100,000 I use per day 
And um, the answer is basically desperate times calls for desperate measures. So take the supplement at your own risk. That is, guys, for today. It's Veronica Vax, naturopathic physician, happily retired. Bye-bye for now.